I got my printer bot upgrade kit. So they came out with the Maker Simple uh, all belt version. And I already had the fishing line version. So they now have this upgrade kit, which was on sale for 45 bucks. I picked it up. And uh, so I'm going to unbox it, see what comes in it. That's different uh, than the other kit I originally got. So it comes in a box. Let's so take a look. Whoa. That looks like pretty much everything there. Box is empty. Okay, so oh, it's all pretty much in this one bag. Some bubble wrap. And we do have an important do not throw away any of your hardware from your current printer bot simple. You will need most of it again. The hardware provides only covers the differences between the two kits. Step one, disassemble your printer bot simple. Well, I've already started on that and I do have a video for it, which might be on part of this. Uh, step two, go to printerbothelp.com for the instructions of the new one. So invoice, we don't need the invoice. Um, and it gives us, oh, this is a little bit different way to do it, but they show us what each part is over here. Um, we have some screws, nuts, bolts, springs. Um, it doesn't give a diagram like it did the one time. So let's open this bag and let's see what is different. We know this is the belt driven one. Um, and see what, what's new that is being added from what we had before. So it looks like we have some new electronics in here. We have a new end stop. Um, and it looks like we might have extension cords for uh, the fan and some of the other end stops and whatnot. Um, this new model has all the stuff underneath it. Um, and then we have new plywood parts, birch plywood. They always smell so interesting. It smells like uh, you have uh, a wood burning fireplace in your house. So they labeled everything, so I'm not sure we can see that, but the wood on this new uh, chassis has got everything labeled. It kind of looks stupid, but I guess it's easier for people that can't read instructions very well. Um, so, well, this is interesting. Looks like it can just come apart really simple. Yeah, so that's the chassis of the printer bot, the new chassis um, for the belt driven version and so the board is actually going to be underneath this section here so you just flip it out and I think it's going to be a little bit better some people said that they don't like that but um, it's real hard to get to the printer board and when you have to adjust the pot for a motor overheating and that does happen uh, it's real hard to adjust for. Let's see what's in this bag. Well, let me open this one up. Let's move that over here. So, so far we got wood parts. We got uh, some extra electronic stuff, mostly extension cables. Looks like a new end stop. Oh. Get this open here. Um, we have three bags of black twist ties, or um, zip ties, um, a new cord extension thing, I already have one, this one looks uh, twice as long as the one I currently have, um, the G2 belts, so we get two belts, one for the X and one for the Y, we get a new motor. This will be for the uh, Y-axis. It's going to replace the small motor the Y-axis used to have. And uh, so let's open that up. And it's basically the same kind of motor that is on the Z, the extruder, and the X now. Same kind. 
Um, we get the auto leveling for the Z-axis. So this is the auto level sensor. This is nice. It's going to be real nice. So I don't have to level the bed all the time. Um, looks like we get two wooden laser cut wrenches. I believe that's for adjusting this. If I saw some of the other videos from PrinterBot, I believe that's what those are for. Um, I do not know what this is for. It's a black shiny piece of plastic. Um, hmm. I'll have to read the instructions. I don't know what that is for. And last we have a bag full of some washers, some bearings, some screws, uh, the new Z coupler, which will be a lot better than the zip tie plastic thing for the Z axis uh, rod. And then we do have the G2 uh, belt things in there. And then the rest of the hardware comes off the old printer bot that I have. So this is the upgrade kit for the new Maker Simple 2014, June 2014 uh, G2 belt driven system with auto leveling. So it's pretty much everything we got. Um, it's still on sale for 45 bucks. Uh, it's going to be 75 so if you want to wait and spend more money, uh, I'd get it now. Um, I ordered this a couple days, uh, almost a week ago, 10 days ago, and it's been sitting at my local UPS uh, warehouse for about five days. They said it was uh, because of severe weather. We have had no severe weather in our location, so UPS, I don't know what your problem was. I think they may have lost the package. Well, that's the um, upgrade kit. I'm probably going to have a video of me reassembling the printer bot, and I do have a video of me disassembling the printer bot. And you know, I originally had an assembly video. So, very interesting. Well, thanks for joining.